Transformers. Remember in Revenge of the Fallen. Remember at the end of the first one and mostly through Revenge of the Fallen. Sam and Michaela were boyfriend and girlfriend, but they weren't officially committed to each other until they said the three words. Right? And when Sam supposedly died, Michaela said those words. And Sam, when he got revived, I've, I've uh, diddled it, if you will, or said the same thing back to her, and thus making a commitment. Yeah, I know a lot of you are saying, well, he doesn't have Michaela anymore in the third one. That's true, but you get what I'm saying, right? Yeah, Sonic and Sally have said it to each other before. But any time you say that to each other, and you're on the verge of being back together as a couple, that's basically saying you're committing each other, committing to each other and no one else. Alright? That's basically what it is. No matter what people say, that's basically what it is. Now you don't now you can be boyfriend and girlfriend and all that and hang out with each other and go out and have somebody to eat, go see a movie and all that at but that doesn't mean you're officially committed to each other just yet unless you say those words or unless you take that first step. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, in closing, again what I'm saying is for those that argue the fact act about are uh, that have been I argue this cover that talk about Amy's position here again let me explain different timeline different dimension different world that's what it is okay so hopefully they cleared some stuff up and hopefully everybody understands now so thank you all for watching or listening in and thank you all for listening in Again, again, different world, different dimension, different timeline. Take that into consideration and think about it. And again, read Sonic X issue 40. You'll get the idea. All right? So, thank you again, thank you all for listening. And I will talk to you all later. You all have a good day.